Okay, Aquarius, welcome to your extended. Let's get started and see what's going on with this person, how they're feeling about all of this. Tell me about Aquarius's person. Three of Wands, overall energy. So they are definitely taking small steps towards this happiness that they feel with you. Past energy, Eight of Swords. Of course, this is being bound to something that causes them a lot of pain, um, trying to be blind to what's happening, trying not to recognize what they're feeling. Current energy, King of Cups. So feeling the love, really feeling the love, feeling the connection between the two of you, but um, not necessarily speaking it. And future energy, two of cups. So great energy, right? So let's tell me about this three of wands. So yeah, again, three of wands is a three, right? We keep getting that three. Here's the lovers. You might be seeing three, 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 like all over the place, or just 33s because of that sort of twin 33 energy that you might be feeling. Um, but Ace of Wands, like they want to start this new, they want to take this action. Four of Swords, it's just taking them, they're figuring out in their head, how do I do this? without causing all the pain but you know there's always going to be pain when you are doing something new there's always going to be a learning curve right tell me about the eight of swords past energy So yeah, 10 of wands. So your person feels like whatever they're bound to, that they carry this, this huge weight with it. Um, they might be like the sole provider. Um, they might feel like if they, they leave that they're like harming their person. Um, and with the five of swords, they don't like conflict and they're feeling conflict and they really don't want a fight. So we've got that Ace of Swords coming up where they're trying to like cut through the BS. They're trying to figure out what this is. The song that's on right now is an Eminem song and it's a, uh, you know, we touch and it's lust and, um, you know, they're trying to figure out what is this in this past energy because they don't want to start this whole fight for something that, you know, is just that this is how they're feeling, like from their lower head instead of their upper head, you know, no gender, whatever it is. Um, so tell me about this current King of Cups energy. Jumper. Double jumper. So yeah, so again, your person isn't talking because of this judgment, because they're having to make this decision, right? If they're going to walk through this door and move on to this new future or not. And they feel this energy with this devil, like there's this temptation and it's this long bunch of obstacles and they're not sure if this is something that they can do. I'm feeling, I don't know if I can do this. Four of Pentacles. They are nervous and restricting and not sharing these emotions with you because they don't want to like destroy everything between you and everything that they have built up because I get this eight of pentacles where they have worked very hard to get where they are. They feel like that they have accomplished all of their passions. Like they have a great life. They have a great life. So why would they want to mess it up? Tell me about this <laughs> two of cups. 
Now they're going to tell me about this Two of Cups. Well, there it is. So we've got them going into this hermit mode, right? Becoming reflective, realizing what this is and what they desire. Wishing it forward. Even with that little bit of deception, this is a full moon almost, right? Like they're, you can see it's not that they're wanting the full moon. So they're wanting to be out of the deception, right? So they're wanting to have this as just a wish, an intention. But what all this is going to create is this tower moment for them where they're going to have to go through this for this two of cups. So let's clarify a little bit more. Tell me about the lovers. Yeah, they're trying to balance all of this. There's that temperance that you had. They're trying to balance all of this. They feel like this full where they can't help themselves, right? They're trying to pull back. They're trying to balance, but they really can't help themselves. And the universe is pulling them into this sacred geometry. With the two of wands, I feel like they have this desire. They're so torn because they have this desire to be wherever you are and at current time, I feel like you are not together, right? But they want to be with you. They want their home to be with you. They feel that home energy. Tell me about Ace of Swords past energy. Yeah, I feel like, so they were trying to kind of play it without really getting into too many details with the strength card here. However, the Ace of Swords was like, you got to cut through the BS. So they came forward with this whole Ten of Pentacles energy of what's going on in their life, what they desire in their life. Um, and it, it comes across very logically, not very emotionally more passionately um, because then we have this chariot and I feel like once they open that up it was like this rush of emotions through them and it triggered everything else that has come since tell me about judgment current energy yeah it really is about them taking that ace of pentacles to you they feel so guilty about doing that but you have taken them away from this pain that they had felt and there's that three of cups and this one is my three of cups where the universe is the one stepping in to bring you together to bring this happiness there's this reuniting so it's bringing them back to you Tell me about the Four of Pentacles. Yeah, there is this fear with them as well as you that you're not taking their cup, but you have. They think you haven't. You do have to open up and let them know. Because um, Six of Wands, they are asking for guidance in this. They are saying prayers or meditating or asking their guides or ancestors for help through this and looking at what they have with this three of pentacles, really trying to clarify if this is what they want. Tell me about the tower and this future energy. That's too many, but there we've got King of Swords, right, on the bottom. One more, please. 
Yeah, so I feel like your person, like they do want something that's fair. They do want justice to be served. And I feel like Queen of Pentacles, they will give their person whatever they have to, to make it fair. Like, they know that they're bringing their pentacle to you. They know that you're getting, like, the benefit of having them and having what they've created. And so they want it to be fair, but they're not going to let that stop them from coming to be with you. So let's pull a couple of cards from the universe. King of Pentacles, Princess of Pentacles, and the Hierophant. So yeah, they, they're going to step up from this player. They are going to offer you something to create with them for this Hierophant commitment. So I hope that this helps, Aquarius, and I will see you next time. Bye.